In this tutorial, I will show you how to customize your theme for your 2PG dashboard. So, I want to I want to make my own theme. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come on this website cuz because I want to get five colors. So, oh, I'll use these colors, I guess. So, I'm going to make this one primary. I'm going to make this one secondary. I'm going to make this one tertiary. In theme.scss, this should change the theme. I'm not sure if it'll make much of a difference. Okay, you can see the yellow secondary color there. So, this will be the background. And what I want to do is get paste that in. If I just want one background, but I don't, I want to make it slightly darker. So, I'm going to do that. And now, we should have shades. Okay, it does look a bit weird. <laughs> okay, so this will be our text, our font, right here. So that's good. Now we've got the main colours. We want to get the palettes, which actually change the inputs as you can see Hang on. the input color is now blue but I want it a different color for example I want it this color so we come to here we name we don't need to name that actually so what we do is we type, we press this, come to this website, link will be in the description. So we're going to paste in our color that we want to make the primary palette out of, which will be for colors for this color. We'll use the primary palette. So paste that in, that's the palette we want. So now we want to view the code that's generated AngularJS2 Material 2. Okay, we just want to copy this and then paste it here. So now we we do have a slight issue. Okay, I did delete one by accident. We can also delete that one, why not? Okay, so we do have a slight issue. We need to rename this. Palette, primary palette. Okay, now we want the secondary palette so we can finish the theme here. So, we're gonna. We want to choose our secondary color. And I'm just gonna have this. Why not? Probably not the best choice for colors. Might get a bit messy. But now we want our secondary palette. So, we paste that in, of course. Then we copy this palette. Then we're also going to rename it to Secondary Palette. There we go. And now we have our palette. And now it's, it's yellow, because why not? <laughs> so, as you can see, the inputs here are yellow. It's pretty good. So now we're on the dashboard, as you can see the color changes are apparent. So now, I don't, personally I don't like this sidebar right here, this color. Probably change that in a future update, but the XP card. And now the, the colors you can see have changed. Now, let's see if we can find a more apparent color change. Different shades here and different input colors, as you can see. There. And that's it. That's how we insert. That's how we change, even. That's how we change the color, the theme. That's how we change the theme. And this is our leaderboard. I'm not sure if there's a difference here. 
I'm just seeing for the differences. There we go. Well done.